Yo, everybody, Joe Salt, the 100 here once again. Really, really game. I had my volume turned off for this game completely. Anyways, as you can see, I am back at Arena 4. I hung out with Snow Valley for a while. Try to get that card, but, uh, as you can see there, I am actually saving up enough coins for it. That is Arena 4. This is Arena 4. This crown chest is Arena 4. I think. Yeah. Arena 4. Arena 4. I have nothing except for Zap from Arena 5. Which actually I really, really like. This is the deck I am currently using. Zap, Minion, Musketeer, Mini P.E.K.K.A, Expo, Giant Skeleton, Skeleton Army, and Baby Dragon. Although, one of these two is soon going to be switched. Um, probably Expo. For something a little bit cheaper. My average cost is still really high. As you can see, I did increase this deck, uh, deck's power a little bit. I could still upgrade that, that, and that, but I'm saving up for the moment. I'm 400 off. Uh, 400 is not going to be there. I don't know when I get it, but I hopefully I will get that mirror. Anyways, let's hop right into a game. Um, I'll be going Skeleton and Dragon. First things first, I almost always attack the right. I'm going on the aggressive right off the bat. Okay, good luck. As you can see there, I have Zap. Zap will be saved. Uh, for a giant and a mini packet. Actually. Let's do Skeleton Army over there. That's a great way to scale down giant in my my personal experience. Put some minions over there. I will attack that horde. Which honestly, I hate dealing with. Now let's save it. Oh, he has a minion or two. I'm actually going to ignore that because I'm ignoring it. Expo here, then I'll do a dragon, musketeer, mini pega. Save up that zap in case. Oh, something like the prince happens. Well, at least I got that down to below a thousand. I'm actually about to zap this guy. Stop him in his tracks, stop that charge. And do decent damage, actually, surprisingly. Now I will wait for him to come here. Mini pick it. Mini pick it out. Wow, I'm surprised this killed mine. Um, let's drop minions here. And then I will do my own skeleton army here. Which will be followed by a musketeer. Which I honestly I don't use enough. Okay, never mind. Let's wait, let's wait. Dragon. Okay, I'm slowly, slowly chipping down at his base here. Ah, no, Prince again. Zap him once again. Minions. That'll decrease him down, that'll kill him. Uh, let's just expo. Because honestly, that expo probably gonna destroy him. And crap, crap, crap. It's gonna be close. There I got it. Good game. Yay, golden chest. That might actually be the answer to all my problems. Oh, hang on. I do want to... Okay, so a cancel doesn't work, apparently. Expo and Mini Dragon. Just turn things off. I will do this, and then summon Expo. Ah, oh, he has a witch. I really could use Zap right now. Drop Minions. Most I can do at the moment. Okay, I will still get that down to 
thousand. Less than a thousand, I mean. Got these oh, army around her. She's distracted with that. Ooh, she's gonna do some major, major damage there. Musketeer, oh, he has a Valk. Valkyrie's probably gonna destroy it. But I'm going to zap because zap. Valkyrie still destroys it. But enough for my tower not to get. Shuffle Baby Dragon. That'll probably maybe destroy that tower, but I'll also put down some minions. And he gets lizard again. Has a Valk and they are oh he has fire spirits. Okay, I'll put a mini pecker down. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, he's seriously doing... Oh, he seriously just destroyed that. I'm sure he has a Valkyrie again, but I'm going to counter this wizard here. And that didn't work. Zap that wizard, the mini pecker, and the bomber. Are actually, just really, really good. Ignore that mini pecker. Much damage as that thing's gonna do. That seriously hurt. Ah. Dang, witch, man. Alright, I'm gonna put a giant skeleton down. If he uses that witch to counter him, and he dies by that witch, witch will die. Okay. Destroy the skeletons. Here's another zap. Oh man, he is devastating me right now. That witch is just so strong. Dang. I was devastated on that one. There's an, I will show you one here. As you can see, he also has the expo. He has the witch. Although she's only level one. He has a hog. It's really the most surprising in my own opinion. As you can see, I did win this one. But this one I was pretty hard pressed. Start out with the expo, followed by skeleton army. You know, just in case he wants to put something over there goes for the freeze with my expo. Some of the zone army. We have pretty similar decks. He has his own Valk, although he's not gonna play it just yet. I don't understand why mine is doing as much to that guy as it is. Matter of fact I really just devastated right there. Surprising even to myself. Did not expect to do that well. I put out the minions that dragon I like to kind of like combo flying with flying you know I see here that my next card's a skeleton army bam try to counter that witch there that giant skeleton works wonderfully although I do put out that skeleton army just to help plus I wanted to get him all the way to that guy's base simple simple didn't quite work so well. I did put the dragon there. That was mainly to counter those skeletons right there. Again, didn't really work. Zap that dragon right there so that mine could win. Full of us minions once again. This is the second time minions and a dragon is getting all the way to that base. But here he drops the expo. That really surprised me, but I immediately dropped my own on his home turf. Gets that hog right at that's another surprise that did not count for. Bam, those skeletons would have countered it, but they did not think so. Freeze, which I find was one of the most annoying things about this match. Now that X tower, just try that tower. Expo, I mean. <laughs> Ain't too worried though, because then it will extend it in the match. Of course, comes worse. Again, I dropped that giant skeleton in the skeleton army. It's 
my favorite combo in the game. He drops a Valk, which, again, kind of surprised me. That time, I did worry about the Expo. Because this time, it can do damage to my tower, my home base. You know, and I'm really wanting to win this. Get, get all three stars. As you can see, I had that crown chest. I really wanted it open. As you can see here, it did go into overtime. That's why I allowed him to destroy that tower. I didn't even try to counter the, that ex the expo. He's getting that, that tower down really far. And if he destroys that game over, they didn't really want that to happen. So I'll go straight on the offensive. As you can see here, he's, he's playing very, very strange. This is the second time his mana has been full and he's not done anything. But I believe this time he just kind of gave up. He's like, all right, you know what? I ain't winning. So I might as well then. I had a lot of surprises in his deck. And I really did not count, count for it. In the end, I did pull it. Let me look at this other guy's deck. This other guy has a really good deck. Well, the fire space from. Yeah, he was in Arena 5. He got some Arena 5, you know. And the fire. W fire Wizard 2. Did not mean to do that. Apologize. He just played against somebody recently who had a Fire Wizard. Why is this game? It's been a minute. Playing against a ton of Merlin. That last one, probably for the day, I'll be doing Skeleton Mini Pekka. Or. Oof. Still put on that, but I'll actually set up for that expo. Zap this real quick. So that we hit more with that there, Skeleton Army. Save up for that expo. Even though that's the second time I've said that. Okay, for some reason, my team just destroyed his team. I don't know why. Oh, he's... Uh, scumbag move, but I... Is my baby dragon now? Now, my baby dragon will probably destroy his, even though his is a higher level. Because his is targeting my expo. Which honestly is a good thing for him because my expo will destroy that tower. Okay, he has some minions too. Ain't no big thing. Bam, destroying that tower. Right, right now. Still a minute 48 to go. I'm going to ignore that for a second. I will zap that in just a second. Except for he destroyed that tower. Crap, that's not an okay thing. I'm actually about to drop my mm. own skeleton army. That will destroy some of them so I can worry about the rest. Okay, I'm actually going to wait for that baby dragon to come. So I can attack it with my tower so I can destroy it. Also, got to worry about them. <sighs> my tower is just... Devastator, I think. If you cannot tell, I am using the word devastator a lot. Oh, no, 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 no. That mini P.E.K.K.A. is going to hurt a lot. Drop my own mini P.E.K.K.A. though. Guys, level 5, he's the same level as I am, but... His cards are a lot better than mine. Although, I did use some of mine that... Level up, just get the new level. Oh, he has a giant skeleton. Oh, crap. That's definitely an amazing thing. Zap all these. I still didn't destroy him. Great. Yeah, that was for the mini P.E.K.K.A. actually. Oh, crap. That's going to hurt really bad, but I'm still going to pull up W. Bam. 
zap for the win. Oh, dang. It's a lot less than I thought it would. Now I'm trying to defend and attack simultaneously. Alright, I, I haven't used a musketeer all around. I don't know why. Give him that good game one more time. Let's end it. I ended this on a W. Oh wow, I am actually in area, f area 5 now. Wait. I didn't even realize the Ice Wizard was here. Wait, that's a. L that's just a wizard. I've always called him the the fire wizard. Okay. I can't wait for this one to come. I'm really looking forward to getting that, but I don't. I will. Anyways, Tilsel signing off. Man, my voice just cracked really bad.